Hi, my name is Lucy Callinham, and normally I write about my experiences as a female coach in my blog, but this week I've decided to do something a bit different and do a vlog. In one of my training sessions with my university team, I decided to ask about their experiences as female coaches and how they feel being uh, coached by a female. I hope you enjoy. when they lead, everyone listens straight ahead to all the guys. But when the girls lead, a lot of people like prat around and don't really tend to listen that much. Mm -hmm. Male-dominated. <coughs> well, so no, yes, Frankie, well done. done. Okay, I've been playing rugby for eight years. And I've never had a female coach, I've always had a male coach. And I feel they can't really relate to the like struggles we kind of have in women's rugby. And it's the first time I've had a women's coach and they can kind of like, well, they've obviously played before, they have experience. And women's rugby is a completely different game to men's rugby, I think. And so they can kind of, well, all their past, past experiences, they can like tell us how to improve on how we already play. And I think I've improved since having a women's or a female coach. Last year. Uh, yes, many, many years ago, but only for a short period of time. Apart from that, it's been all male coaches. No, I've never had any female coaches. I was brought up playing with the boys, so when the team kind of separated from females to males, the, the male coach carried on training the females. And the male... Oh no, I've got a penguin ability. There aren't, I don't know of any female coaches apart from Lucy. I only know of, well, all males really. And I think it's really important that people that play rugby, like me for example, do like do coaching courses because then when, well, I leave university, I can go on and coach my own like, women's team. And I think it is important. And there are more opportunities to do it. Like I'm going on a coaching course with Lucy, Ash, I think, in um, a few weeks' time or months' time. And then I'll be able to go and when, when Lucy leaves, I'll be able to take over or I'll be able to do a coach my own team when I graduate from the university. I've been coaching for about four months now. Um, I've done a little bit here and there through my past teams, but now I'm actually coaching the team that I don't play for, which is very, very interesting and much different to what I'm used to. Stop and it is yeah. I think it's so much better to have a female coach because they relate to what you feel as well. Where men kind of go in for the heavy handedness, where females can kind of go back a bit and work back on the basics and. They relate to how you feel in a game situation as well. I think having female coaches is very important, especially for female players. We feel much more understood and feel like we can um, definitely relate more to our coaches. 